What's up guys, Louis here. I'm all about saving time. Like anything at all, I need to save time. If I can find a system to do it, I will do it. And because a lot of stuff is tedious that we do. So for instance, today we're talking about emails and Google groups and how to use them to speed up your email process and your communication process. And there's a few really cool hacks to stay tuned for. Now, if you haven't been here before, guys, I drop videos all the time on systems, processes, and time management for realtors to let you have a more productive and happy life and to scale your business. So subscribe, like, comment, do all that good stuff. Let's dive into the computer. All right, guys, so today we're gonna to jump into Google Groups. Now, if you're looking at my inbox and you're like, oh, that looks nice, then check out the video that is up here. That is gonna show you exactly how to set this up for your zero inbox emailing system. So why would we want groups in the first place? Well, it's actually a really quick way to email a bunch of people at once. Obviously, that's why it's called groups. But what do I use this for? Well, I use it for my team, obviously, because I need to email a bunch of them at the same time for different updates, different masterminds that we're doing. And then also I use it for people, a group of people who I'm working with for a deal. So that might be Mr. Buyer, Mrs. Buyer, uh, the lender and the title rep, you know, all in one thing. So I can just click and we're good to go. Or again, it might be the seller. So it might be, you know, the Mr. and Mrs. Seller, you know, plus my uh, assistant who, who does all my TC work and who the, does the photography and all that stuff. Okay, so any kind of quick group that you're working with is really, really cool because you can bring them up super duper quick. And I use this again with like an entire deal. So I'll add in the, you know, the listing agent, if I'm with the buyer, the title, you know, my TC, her TC, I'll have it all in one group so I can just click on it and go. So let me show you what I mean instead of actually talking about it. Okay, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna come up here and you're gonna click on the Google Apps. Now, I know I'm talking about groups, but I'm not actually talking about Google Groups right here. I'm talking about contacts and we're gonna make them into groups. I know, weird language, whatever. You're just gonna scroll down here and come to contacts. What you're gonna do is you're gonna create the contacts um, inside of your little group here. Now you can just search for them inside of your Gmail. So you come up here. So let's make a buyer and lender little group, okay? So I'm gonna search here and I'll just search for my own um, email here. So I'm gonna see me right here. So that's me, um, that's another email of mine. And if I wanna add them in, I'm just gonna go here to this tag. So this label, I'm gonna create a label and I'm gonna see one, two, three, main street deal. Okay, save that label. So now you can see it's created this label over here that now Louis is a part of. Awesome, that's great. Okay, now we need um, Louis' partner. Here's another one of my email addresses. Same thing, let's add him in here. So we're gonna go add them in to 123 Main Street Deal and you're gonna go apply. Now make sure you do this because when I first started doing this, I was just clicking this and clicking off of it and it doesn't save. So make sure you click, add the label and then apply. Boom, perfect. Now we can see that there's two people in the 123 Main Street deal, Mr. Mrs. Seller. Now let's look for the lender. And I've got a third email, I think. Nope, you know what? Let's add in Mackenzie, my wife. Let's add in her and let's click her and add her to 123 Main Street deal. Let's say she's the lender, okay? So now you can see I have this little group of us and we are working on this deal together. And it's the two buyers and the lender. And again, look, I might add in, you know, the title rep once we get there or whoever you need to add into the, the deal, you can add them into this little group. And now the cool thing is, if we go back to our Gmail here, if we go to compose, all you have to do now is instead of typing in all their separate emails, I'm just gonna type one, two, three, and look at that, one, two, three, Main Street deal. Click that and everyone will be added to the email automatically. Now, if you've got people who you don't want them to see each other's email addresses for whatever reason, you can come to BCC and you can go one, two, three, Main Street. 
and now it will send but it will send as undisclosed recipients so they won't see each other's emails if you want to do it that way i do that with my group because there's just too many emails to look at so if you bcc it it doesn't have all that noise in there and then you'll just do your subject as usual send the email and then you're good to go it will just send to everyone now you might be like well this is like whatever but i'm telling you if you start putting these together for the deals you're working, for the groups of clients you're working with, maybe you work with a nonprofit, maybe you work with a team, whatever it is, if you just add them all, it's super duper easy to add them in. So, you know, for me, so if I wanna add in my entire group, I'll just type in elevation and everyone will pop up there, like this, boom. And if I click it, all their emails will show up. Super, super cool way to do things. The other thing you have to know about this is that there's a limit of 250 people per label. Okay, so just know that. But if it gets too big, you can always call it, you know, elevation one, elevation two tags, and you can just add everyone in there because you can add more than one group in here. So if we go one, two, three Main Street, and then I also do elevation, I can add everyone in there and everyone is going to come in. So there's a 250 limit, but you can just separate them, you know, into groups of one and two. If you work with a neighborhood, you know, watch or, or like a neighborhood Facebook group and you have more than that, then you can put them into different sections, but super, super quick. Now you don't have to find all the emails, add them all together and do all the things. You can just add them into those labels and then you can send them straight away. A little time hack, but it really, really helps if you're trying to just stay productive, get things done without having to think about it too much. So there you go, guys. If you like this kind of stuff, I drop videos on this all the time for realtors, helping them with systems, processes, and time management to scale their business. If you haven't been here before, subscribe to the channel, drop a comment below, let me know what you think about this system and if it works for you, and I will see you on the next one.